American tennis superstar Chris Eubanks hitting the court this morning at Wimbledon for the men's quarterfinals. Yeah, at the uh, Cary Leeds Tennis and Learning Center in Crotona Park, dozens of young players are cheering him on. Pix 11's Kieran Dillon is joining us live from there with more on all the excitement. Kieran, good morning. Hi, good morning, Hazel and Dan. What a great morning, right? A beautiful day and a lot of excitement. This game where Chris Eubanks was going to hit the court, Wimbledon, men's quarterfinals. So it's going to be at 9.15. Now it's going to come up in the next five minutes. The game's going to start at 9.20. And take a look who's watching. Who's going to be cheering him on? We are here at Cortona Park. Come on, guys. How excited are you? Cortona Park at the Cary Leeds Tennis and Learning Center. These are all young tennis players that are here for summer camp. They're all players taking time out of their day today to watch Chris Eubanks. Why? Well, I'll tell you why. He has a special connection to this uh, center, in addition to just being an inspiration for so many ten tennis players across the country. With more on, on that, I want to bring in Asha Roll, who is N with NYJTL, as well as uh, Jeremy Victoria, who is one of the players here. So, guys, tell me, what, why are we cheering on Chris today? What's so special about him? Yep. Yeah, so, Chris uh, visited our center, actually, in December. He came for a holding court series that we had. He came and he did several clinics with our kids. So, we have a special connection to Chris. So, he was supporting us us and we would love to support him. Oh my gosh, Asha. So how did you score that? I mean, look at how well he's done. I know uh, at the time he wasn't as high up. Now he's in the top 100, mm -hmm. top 50 players in the country. But uh, at that time, how did you score that get for him to come down and spend time with these kids? Yeah, so Chris and I actually have a coach in common. Uh, we, we were coached by the same uh, person. And um, I met him at Indian Wells and then I asked him to come and talk to our kids. Um, it's super important for them to be able to see themselves on TV. Chris went to regular high school. He went Went to college and he's now doing amazing on the tour so our kids have to hear his story and I'm so excited we're able to support him got it so uh, what are some of the other things about him I know you were telling me off camera that he is one uh, the only one of three black men to make it this far in Wimbledon really incredible yeah super incredible and almost even more incredible to me is that this is his first time playing Wimbledon and he's already made it to the quarterfinals I don't think people realize how hard that is so we're just here happy to support and show our support for him maybe he might be the next Chris Eubanks who knows Jeremy are you the next Chris Eubanks yes <laughs> <laughs> no I really I mean I, I hope you I hope you are definitely I think everybody here you know has aspirations for just that and so you were here you met Chris, you were telling me a little bit about that experience in December. What was that like for you? Uh, he's a great guy. It just shows how he is as a person. He's a great competitor, and it's super inspiring that you could be a good competitor and also be a great person. You were telling me he even talked to you. He came here. He coached you a little bit, but then he even talked to you uh, outside of the center. Tell me about that. Well, a lot on his life experiences, how he's seen a lot in the tennis world, and it's a good inside look on how it is to be a professional tennis player. And he, he was also very like warm and welcoming, and not many people are like that. And you said he was even replying to your Instagram DMs. Yeah, yeah, it was it was a it was a pretty big thing for me because it just shows how he is as a person, and he takes his time out for like every every one of us as a player. Right, and so of course, I mean, so it's always nice to see big superstars like this that are doing so well make it so far, isn't it? Absolutely, we have to be able to provide these experiences for our kids and show them, you know, hear, let them hear the pathways to success and hopefully they see themselves in these athletes. Yeah, totally. Well, thank you so much for speaking to me, you guys. Take a look again. Oh, we're just. We're just hearing that Chris Eubanks is getting ready to hit the court. He's about to get up there, and I think he's actually talking to some to some fans right now, taking some pictures. So that sounds just on brand for him, right? Because, uh, or in character, I should say, because uh, we are hearing that he's just a great guy. So everybody here at the Carrie Leeds <laughs> Carrie Leeds Center is cheering him on. We all are as well, you guys. We'll be watching the game is about to start. Lots of excitement here. I'll send it back to you.